then. Good. If that is the case. Then this world is mine. Mordigan has played his hand. The game is all but won. A shroud of deepest darkness has eclipsed the shining sun. And yet, amid the shadows, glimmer tiny specks of light. Faint, flickering flames that rage against the coming of the night. How can such sparks of hope remain? When darkness rules the land, now evil reigns supreme. Who has the strength to take a stand? Alive. But how? <laughs> Sylve! Sylve! Oh, thank goodness you're all right. Sylve! Stay with me, Sylve. <clears throat> oh, there you are. You all right, Sylph? Hmm? Oh, oh, sure, Davi, honey. I, I, I was just getting a little air. Being cooped up in that cabin was driving me crazy, you know? Oh, come on, Sylph. Cheer up, will ya? I don't think I can take much more of this moping. That day, when Mordegon... There was nothing I could do. He was just too powerful. I thought it was the end for me. For all of us. But this... This is worse than death. To wake up and find everybody gone. And the world consumed by darkness. I'm sorry, Dave, but I just... I can't do this. I know I should feel lucky to be alive, but without the others... I'm nothing. Nobody. Right. That's enough of that. Huh? <laughs> Have you lost your... Bleeding marbles. Since when were them mates of yours the types to let some Lord of Shadows numpty get the better of them, eh? How about you have a bit of bleeding faith in them like you used to? Or did you think saving the world was gonna be easy or something? <sighs> oh, Dave, darling. You're right. <clears throat> If a slip of a thing like me was able to get out of that tangle with Mordegon alive, then the others must have done too. And here I am feeling sorry for myself instead of getting out there and trying to find them. What would Veronica and Eric say if they <coughs> saw me like this? <laughs> That's more bleeding like it. It's good to have you back, me old mucker. <laughs> oh, it's good to be back, believe me. Now, enough chit-chat. It's time for action. 
We need to make land at the nearest port and find out just how much of a mess the world is in. And once we've done that, we can make a start on fixing it. Sounds like a plan, Sylv. Nearest harbor to here would be over in Gondolia. I'll plot a course right away. That sounds just perfect, honey. Anchors away! Hoist the mainsail! Gondolia, here we come! <laughs> aye, aye, Captain. Or Condolia. Hard to believe it used to be the busiest, most bustling trade port in the old wide world, ain't it? I mean, it ain't a surprise or nothing. But when a lively place like this falls on our times, well, it's just sad, that's all. Still, no use in moping, I suppose. Come on, Sylph. Let's have a mooch around and see what locals got saved for themselves, shall we? Condolia. Oh, here we go. Hey there, everyone. My name is Kit, and welcome back to Dragon Quest XI. And ooh, look at this little idle, idle animation. That's cute. Anyways, welcome back. Everything is in turmoil. Everyone is depressed. Everyone is dead. It is, uh, do stuff. Her favor. You must be careful, the Beasley Boys. They see you are a traveler, and they attack you immediately, Subito. Already they steal the knapsack of a man who just arrived in town. I see him walk to the piazza after it happened. He looks so sad. The piazza, what's that? I don't know what that is. That's what I'm asking. See, this is what I want. Why can't we do this? You know, just like play as other characters in the overworld. See, I don't know why, but this does actually feel different compared to always playing as a hero and whatnot. But no use in moping, so, you know. Where are we going exactly? I actually don't remember. We are to talk to the Beastly Boys, yes? Talk how they how they went intergalactic. Is there a thing that tells us? The dogs, Doge's house? Let's visit Doge, Let's see what happens. Much steel. Best wow, whatever the heck. Santo Cielo, it is you. You and your friends helped my, my my little Placido, you see? Ah, but how about... <clears throat> but how things changed here since the happy time? After it yourself fell, it worse. It's worse and worse every day. We lose many things, but you know the most important thing we lose. La più importante is hope. If only we have hope, then we can go on to live. But it's no easy. Finding hope in the world is su such as this, in Fati, is almost impossible. In impossible, impossible by you. And everyone here, they know this. <clears throat> yes, yes. Now, we're Beastie Boys, yes? Maybe they, they were the people that were like in the area underneath. Like I guess I'll some people in the little market area. I know who the Beastie Boys are, I don't know where they are though. You see, they're interplanetary, intergalactic planetary. Oh yeah, here they are. Hey, mind your own business, will you? We're having a private conversation here, clear off. Wait, are these it? I'm pretty sure these are it. For a favor, you must believe me, this is all I have. Honestamente. Please, please, yes. Oi, who told you you can watch? Go on, get out of there. Yes. The Beastie Boys. They tried to steer from the shop of my brother. I come here to help him, but I, now I am frightened and I cannot move. Perdonami. Dear brother, forgive me. I am such a coward. Can I, you know, do something about it? Come on, Silvando, use your night perk where you just kind of like beat people up for no reason. That's an that's an Octopath Traveler reference. 
Kind of. Kind of. Eventually we'll go there, but hey, we, you, you never know when. <clears throat> Scusa, the duck is closed. Scusa, babara boopy? Babara boopity babara babara. Let's go. Might as well explore a little bit, see if there's anything that changed. <clears throat> Stock up on some uh, herbs. Wait, you're not the herb guy. Here we go. How much do I have? 3,000? Utility belt. Whose deafness, you say? That. It looks like I still have some from my uh, past travel, so we, let's just end off there. <clears throat> if only there was like a little area we can where we can actually play as Veronica, so we can see her her little Naruto run all the time. But unfortunately, there's not. Apparently, these little these little uh, segments where you where you play as like. The, the different uh, people or like or the different party members are act is actually new to the S version definitive edition I mean as far as I know I I did play the the PC version which is like the original but but uh I didn't actually finish it so I can't really say anything yeah in the PC one I, I tried doing the 100% run and, and then I kind of gave up on it as stated before where am I going Can I not confront the uh, Beastly Boys? Can I not listen to their album? You know, I gotta admit, the, the hang about, we ain't even finished talking to the locals yet, come on. So we're supposed to talk to everyone? Yes, yes. Maybe. Oh, well, we you already talked to them. I gotta admit though, I've never heard any other beast Beastie Boys song than other than you know, other than uh, the intergalactic one, which is like the only one you should listen to really. The only reason I even know about it is because uh, I just randomly heard it during one of my Spotify radio things. Dude, my life has been such so much better. Be even in the dark times, I hear the voice of Luciano. But Spotify has changed my life, man. Come on. It's amazing. Oh, I forgot yeah, about this hey. guy. Hmm? Don't worry, honey. It happens to us all. Hmm? Oh. You're one of those minstrel types, are you? Look, if it's money you want, you better go and hassle someone else. I haven't got a penny to give you. Sorry, darling. No can do. It's against my policy to leave people all alone when they look as down in the dumps as you do. <sighs> look, why don't you just tell me what's on your mind? A problem shared is a problem halved. Hmm? That's better. Now we can talk properly. Silvando, entertainer extraordinaire at your service. Mm -hmm. Right. Well, my name's Tetsu. I'm a blacksmith from Hotto. Though I haven't been back in a long old while. I'll tell you my story if you really want. But I'm warning you, it doesn't have a happy ending. After all those years away, I thought it was time for me to finally head home, see how my mother was doing, you know. But then the minute I set out on my journey, Yggdrasil fell. That just made me even more desperate to get back, of course. I was so worried about her. 
I managed to make it as far as Gongolia, but then my luck finally ran out. My luggage was stolen by a gang of thieves who've been terrorizing the town. The Beastly Boys, they call themselves. I can't make the journey to Hotto without all my things, especially not the lilies of the valley I brought for my mother. They're her favorite flower. I wanted to give them to her to say, well, to say sorry for being away for so long, for leaving her all alone. <laughs> oh, honey, believe me, I know exactly how you feel. Fear not, friend. Your mother will get her flowers. Dave and I will make sure of that. All you need to do is tell us where we can find these beastly boys. Oh, well, if you're sure. There are two merchants, brothers who run establishments in the southern part of town. I've heard that the Beastly Boys have been hanging around, causing trouble at the Older One's stall. A stall in the south of town, huh? All right, we'll be back before you know it. Dave, darling, let's roll! W wait Look, I appreciate you trying to help me, but these are real thugs we're talking about here, and no offense, but you're just an entertainer, right? I wouldn't want you getting hurt. <laughs> oh, don't you worry about me, sweetie. I'm more than just a pretty face, you know? All right, <clears throat> now we can actually take on these uh, beastly boys. By the way, I heard thumping, and the microphone actually picked something up. So I'm, I am very lo siento if you actually if you actually hear those. There's nothing I can do. I mean, I can yell at them to stop, but what that, what's that gonna do? Nothing. Right, I can't even get them to stay out of my room. Clear off. Well, if I had a charm, ain't you die? Ah, hilarious. We can pick around a clown. If you want it, you're gonna have to take it from us. Get him, boys. Beastly boys draw near. Room for a little one, Sylph. Oh, that's it. Abilities. Luckily, to me. Agility increased. Well, good thing Dave here has a. Uh, has good um, good health or infinite health I should say let's see do I have anything if I do what does this do take this routine that can confuse all enemies let's see if this works it worked on two of them oh come on even in Dragon Quest, my confusion never works. Beastly boy in training. Completely confused. He's rooted to the ground, he doesn't know what to do. Let's see, machine, machine, machine. Retrospect, I should have used what's it called? Uh, the other thing. Ufo. <laughs> Agility returned to normal, but he but he's both confused and shocked. Dude, he can't do anything. Yeah, losers. Can't do anything. He's a. Uh... Now, if you don't mind. The one the grass tattoos knapsack. What we gonna do with this horrible lot then, Sylve? Well, beastly they may be, but they're not exactly the dangerous thugs we heard about. They can barely swing a sword. What's your story, boys, huh? We didn't start out as criminals. 
They were fishermen. And very happy fishermen at that. But after Yggdrasil fell, he couldn't take the boats out anymore. Have you seen the sea lately? It's swarming with monsters. Things were just impossible. Most days, we barely had anything to eat. The world might as well have ended that day. We lost our families. We lost everything. And no one came to help us. So we had to choose between a life of crime or starving to death. And that's no choice at all. Watch closely, darlings. This is just an ordinary steel pike, yes? Mm hmm Think again! <laughs> From arms to... Mm. Who's for fresh bread, huh? <gasps> bon appetit, beastly boys. Eat your fill and forget your wicked ways. You'll be beaming again before you know it. Yeah, the bread is steaming. Wait! Who... Who are you? Me? Oh, nobody. Just someone who likes to see people smile. <laughs> Hooray! Now let's go give uh, Tetsu his knapsack so he can go see his mum. And give her the flowers that she that he picked out. Because they're her favorite. And let's let the Beastly Boys enjoy their steel. Get him get him themselves some uh, some physical defense on the side. You're back, and in one piece too, thank goodness. I suppose you managed to recover my nemesis as well. Yes. <gasps> oh, thank goodness. They're still in one piece. Now I can go home to my mother with my head held high. Thank you, Mr. Silvando. Oh, here. It's not much, but I want you to have these. Oh, Tetsu, darling. Whatever they are, I'm sure they're wonderful. <laughs> You're such a sweetie. Honestly, you deserve much more. Come and visit me in Hotto sometime. I'll be able to thank you properly. Now, I'd better be off. I tell you to be careful, but I've got a feeling you'll be just fine. Bye for now. <laughs> ta -da. Here, you all right, Sil? Oh, I'm better than all right, darling. I found it. My purpose in life, my raison d'etre. You know how I've been so down in the dumps thinking about all the despair and suffering in the world? Well, if that's what's making me so unhappy, there's only one thing to do about it. Get out there and fix the problem. Help make people happy again. Just because I can't save the world with some grand heroic gesture that doesn't mean i can't do it one smile at a time that's my sylve i'm with you all the way hmm. yes we heard everything you just said huh? they sent tea leaves from before I hope they ain't spoiling for another fight. Didn't they learn a lesson first time round? Hey. You have to let us come with you. 
You have to let us help people. We're done with our life of crime, thanks to you. You want to tag along? Hmm. Well, I hope you understand it won't be easy. I can't guarantee you'll get home in one piece. We don't care! Hmm. Hmm. Well, in that case, welcome aboard, darlings. Yes! Three new friends join Savando's merry band. Now, as luck would have it, I've got you all a welcome gift. Here, take one each now. Don't be greedy. <gasps> wow. Oh, they're simply fabulous. Darlings, you look splendid. I don't get it, Sylph. What are they? They're the presents dear old Tetsu gave us. If we're going to be traveling around spreading happiness and laughter, we'll need to look the part, no? He was just carrying that? All right, we're all set. Let's get out there and bring some sunshine back into the world. <laughs> Sylvando's super special smile spreading parade starts right here. Yay! Yeah! Right, how about we get out of here and find some more folks in need of help, eh? Reckon we could do worse than, than take a butcher's round the Laguna de Gondolia place for a start. Yes. Lich. I've already done some leveling up, so hopefully... This shouldn't take too, too long. I know how uh, lengthy these can be. I think there's new monsters here too. Right? Could be wrong. Besides, these are all like normal enemies. I thought the... the what was that? Oh, I think that was just a staff. Uh, where are we going? Galopolis. This is the- there are new enemies. I think the tiger's gonna run away because of the, the guy. Vicious Morphean Mushroom. Ooh, that reminds me! While I was grinding, I found something. I found two things, actually. Take this! How come he doesn't use the spear? Woo! Ooh, that's a lot. Uh, it's over here. Yes, yes, I remember. Yeah, the, the defeated monsters. Uh, the, 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 all of them. Watch this. Promage Frey, Rongo Brongo. Where is the ting? Am I even doing progress? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, here's one of them. Look at this thing. This is a rare monster. I found it in the... In the... What's it called? The... 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 The tree. Eat yourself. Yeah? I know it's not much, but... Finding rare monsters is a really fun thing. Now, where's the other one? Mask Jade. Wait. Right. Leader of the Beastly Boy. Hey, check it out. They're here now. Vicious Morphean Mushroom. Infanticorn. Where is it? Mimic. Catwitch. Hamwitch. Runny exoskeleton. So where is it? There was like a panda. I found a panda at, at some point. Oh, there it is. Look at this, a panda. This thing actually packed quite a wallop, weirdly enough. The panda. It's a rare monster. 
I know, again, it's not much, but I, I just like knowing that those are there. What's this? Give me it, whatever it is. I want it. Recipe book. I love iron armor. It's not like we're gonna do very much with that anyways. Do I have the crossbow, Silvando? Probably not. I like how he attacks using his, uh... What's it called? The snap thing. Ah, oh, and I'm poisoned. My agility is down. Sobering slap, that's what it's called. Hopefully this works. Yeah, I worked on one of them. Take this. Midnight Horde Night. They really want to make me slow. Now that's beastly. Leave it to me. Steering shanty. I forgot you can do that. Take this. Yo, oh, he came to his senses. I wonder, does uh, a, does agility have like a hidden mechanic? Like I, I remember, I think I can't remember where it was, but darn it. But I, I I can't remember where there was an RPG uh, that I played some time ago, and uh, it doesn't tell you, but uh, what you called? Do I not have any antidotes? No, I do not. But uh, speed actually affected your your evasiveness and even your attack slightly. Yeah. So is that? Any different from here? I never thought about it until now. Guess I'm poisoned for like a little bit. Who are you? Rats. He's really sad at the rats, poor guy. Greetings, fellow travelers. Yawn. I am Peripatetic Priest. When you need yourself, fellow, resolve to roam Urgia, bringing comfort and solace to those who might need, need it most. Alas, there is only so much that one man can do, Jan. For every person that can, I help, there, there are ten that I fail. Their, pain, their pained voices haunt me constantly. They keep me awake at night. In fact, I can barely remember the last time I slept. I am so Jan, tired. I, fe I, fear, I fear I may be unable to com continue my mission. When I was a Jan, boy, my mother would give me a cup of hot milk whenever I couldn't sleep. It always seemed to do the trick. I'm sure it would work too now too, but sadly things aren't quite that simple. You see, the milk my mother gave me was yawn, no ordinary milk, oh no. She said it came from the from a talking cow. Now, as luck would have it, there's a talking cow gazing near here, sadly. Recent events appear to have put her in melancholy mood, and she can no longer yawn, produce milk. Wait, I have an yawn idea. You're an entertainer, aren't you? Do you think there might be anything you could do to cheer her up? Sure. It to us, darling. We'll have a smile on that cow's face in no time. Flat. She'll be ma she'll be making milk like nobody's business before you know it. Well, thank you. Thank you ever so much. He should be grazing just to the west of here. Good luck. Silvando finds a ch chunk of whatever the heck that said. Chunk of milk. Ooh, that's some chunky milk. Moo, the outlook's utterly gloomy. I can't pre I can't predict the weather anymore. And I can't predict produce a drop of milk either. There is Sylph. Me and old Granny used to, used to have a dairy cow. Whenever an old move got down in the dumps, we'd do a couple of songs and dance numbers and she'd be happy as Larry in no time. I reckon the time to get to work on this one here and all. It's gotta be worth a try, eh? Attempt to cheer up the cow? Yes. Did someone say song and dance? I think that can be arranged. This, bo this bovine's beauty in... And for the show, well, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, I could talk, I swear. Come on, boys, let's give it everything we got. Wahoo, or woohoo. 
So Vonda would go give it their all and put on the performance of a lifetime to break up the poor sad cow. Moo, I feel better. The gloom is lifting. In fact, I feel utterly fabulous. Thank you, my friend. That was Sniff. Very moving. I feel much better now. Here, please take this by way of thanks, Moo. <gasps> a vial of fresh milk. Why would you put that in a vial? Nice one. Now, now we can got now we got some of that old special milk the priest couldn't sleep wanted. Let's go and give him a, a glug or two, shall we? The cow says. I'd be ever so grateful if I could have finished and give the yes. Oh my word, this is it. This is the milk that my mother used to give me. I don't believe it. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm sure I'll finally be able to get some sleep once I've had a cup of this. But this is really alright. I mean, there are so many people who still need help. Darling, please, don't be so hard on yourself. If you want to help other people first, you've got to look out for number one. You can't do anything if no, nobody has... Even yet. You can't do anything for anybody if you're half asleep. Yes, yes, you're right. Feeling guilty about everything I feel to do, to do won't get me anywhere. And it won't help anyone else either. I suppose I've known that deep down. But now I see it clearly. The rain is gone. And it's all because of you. Thank you. I mean it. Oh, honey, don't mention it. Now, come on. Get some milk down so you so you can sleep. Well, keep, we'll keep an eye out for monsters. Don't worry. So, Vondo and Co. watch over their new friend as it... As he falls into a deep and peaceful sleep, then morning comes. Uh, this reading. What is this reading? I haven't slept that well in years. Goodness me, I feel so much better. And what more? I come to a decision. I realized that that I'll be able to help a lot more people if I join forces with you. After all, there's only so much one man can do by himself. So, what do you say? Will you allow me to come with you? Yes. Of course, darling. Helping people is what we're all about. Well, thank you. Thank you ever so much. This is going to be wonderful. I just know it. Yay! A new member. Now he gets a staff. I wonder. Yeah! He's a healer! Alright. We technically have infinity health, don't we? That was a mistake. I am very sorry, but it's very funny because he said Ariba. Aruba. Hey, he does get a staff. <laughs> it's Dave stuff. Staff. Stuff. Drop kick. Oh, kick. Cast fishing net? That's a thing he can do? Take this. Dead. Huh. Ooh, look at him go. Is that all you got? How much? What's that? Uh oh. Sign. Uh, da, 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 da. How much more do you need until nine more people should do it? Until you level up. Come on, boys. Oh no. Hey, I can do this. Wait, what? I'm about to benefit this ability. Oh, that's probably because they're not actually actually part of the party. In traditional ways. I'm awake. Ooh. Take this. Launch isn't. Wait, we're putting the enemy to sleep. <laughs> he was reciting. Yep. Beastly boy in training. Hey, we did it. it. Yeah, I don't want to deal with the money hands. This ain't hard mode where where uh, it actually matters. I am going the wrong way. No, I'm going the wrong way. Was I supposed to know? Oh, the bloody, the muddy hands actually run away from me. Well, it's because they're uh, lower level than me. That's why. I kind of miss the random encounters, to be honest. Is there a way to actually, like, switch? 
So that that it is. Oh, actually, there is, but it's only on 2D mode for some reason. Eventually, we'll have to do a uh, 2D mode playthrough. I haven't done it. I've only done uh, the like that thing I showed you. We 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 we, we did to like show it off. Back when it was new. Hey, we did it! Additional herb. I can use this kind of maybe. Onward to new places. Yes. When playing the Silvando makes me wish that I really can just place other people in the overworld. It would be nice. Uh, it's not. Let's not. If only I can ride the horse. Can I? Nope. <laughs> Oh man, things are only gonna get tougher from here. Shadow uh, enemies are a pain. Where are you? Oh, whoa, it is you, isn't it? You're the great Silvando. I sure am, honey. And who might you be? Hmm? Oh, I'm nobody. Not yet, anyway. I just joined the circus in Galapagos, you see. Oh, the others aren't going to believe this. It's such an honor to meet you. You're the reason I chose the life of, of the entertainer, you know? One look at you, at you in action, and I knew the, what I wanted to be. I ran away and joined up as soon as I could. Oh, stop it. You're making me blush. But wait, if you're in the circus in Galapagos, what are you doing all the way out here? Well, to cut a long story short, we're closing down. Nobody wants to see people climbing around when the, world, when the world's the way it is. But you're doing one last performance first. Or we're doing one last performance. Got to go out with a bang, right? Trouble is, we don't have enough people to pull it off. What the ringmaster got planned. So that's what. So that's why I'm out here. I'm on the hunt for people who want to taste of showbiz before it's too late. Sadly, there don't, there don't seem to be v many people around. So I suppose you know what's coming. Well, will you join us for one last big show? Yes, I will. Well, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. With the great Silvando at the top of the bill, it's going to be a night to remember for sure. Ah, but even with you on board, we're still a couple of performers short. I don't suppose you could help us look for two more people who'd be willing to join in. Don't bother with the desert coming out. Here in was a stupid idea. I should have st stuck with downtown Galopolis. There's always plenty of talent there. And with your reputation, not to mention your powers of persuasion, they'll be they'll be queuing around the block to sign up. Right. I'd better head back into the big top and start getting ready. Stop by and see me if you need anything if you want some advice on who to recoup. Good luck, and thanks again for all your help. Yes. Yes. Ooh, shadow uh, chimeras. And prestigion materials. Yep. Ooh, dang. Got bo get bodied. Take this. I wonder if that healing dance affects them. Cause meant to heal everyone in the party, right? Well done, ever. Ooh, shadow, restless nights. Imagine you're imagine snapping your fingers so hard that it causes damage. I'm pretty sure that's a thing, right? Ten Q Fishing net. Ten Q 
Another fishing net. We can use that actually because it's a restless night. That scared me for a moment because I thought he died. But he has infinite health, so it's okay. He blocked one of them. See that? Well done, everyone. He's too fast. Restless knights are too fast. Shed, nope. What's the minstrel doing over here? Greetings, good sir. You might be wondering why a bard is doing in a place such as this. Well, the truth is that I set on a journey to inspire the world through medium of rhythm and rhyme. Alas, I am learning that music is far more subjective matter than I had thought. Not so long ago, I was forced to perform a, for a group of dancing monsters who had no appreciation for my work whatsoever. Hmm, where was this? Oh, it was south of Galapolis. Not a place where I, where I should be visiting again. Do be careful. You should be. You should have cause to venture there. Pause. Caution. Let us rest. Because this guy can actually sleep now. South of Galapolis. Is there actually anything? Yes, there is. If only I had a horse with me. That'd be kind of cool. That'd be super coolio to have a horse. And hey, why can't we have a... Uh, what's it called? Silvando's horse here. What's this? Oh look, there they are. For favor, please, you must help. Alright, alright, take it easy. What you got... What's gotten into you, eh? Look over there, poor I Ahi. I am a caballero from Porto Valor. I heard that very many people were suffering after the fall of each so, so I felt it was my duty to try and help them. Aye, but being a hero is much harder than I realized. When I saw these monsters, I froze in fear, and now I can do nothing. It is shameful to ask, but I have no choice, poor, poor, poor favor, senor. What do you have? How did they get the little line on the on, on the end? I am quite curious, actually. Well, will you help me? Will you help these people in my place? Yes, I will. It's your lucky day, darling. When it comes to biffing bullies, beasties, biffing bullying beasties, there's no one like the great Silvando. Muchas gracias. You are a very con courageous hombre. I am not. So, I will have to stay here until you are done with him. You know that meme that says everyone gangster until this happens? Wait, what's going on? I wasn't expecting a long dialogue. But yeah. What's it called? Uh, da, 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 da. Everyone gangster until something happens. That's true, mate. Ah, crap. Yeah, loser. How does that even happen? It's busy boogieing. Well, that's two of them put to sleep. Take this. We'll hit the sleeping one, why not? Completely confused. Calls for backup, but nobody shows up. Oh, he's still asleep. Fast asleep still. Take this. Dead. This is, yeah, it works on all of them. Look at that. I wasn't expecting that. Spiky ball. Yo. Uh, uh, I don't really have anything that's super good. Actually, I can flame slash. Fast asleep. Leave it to me. See Shanty, why didn't you do that before? Oh that 
poor gay. That we scared him. Mid heal. I wonder if there are any hidden mechanics in Dragon Quest. Leave it to me. I'm quite curious. And why are hidden mechanics even a thing? I, I, I'm pretty sure that there's somebody like in the in the overworld that actually tells you about them. I'm sure. I really thought you were done. For, I, I really thought I really thought we were done for, for when we ran into those monsters. Thanks ever so much for stepping in for when you did. Thank you very much for helping us, mister. We're going home now. Bye-bye. The mother and daughter set off on their journey home. Muchas gracias, senor. I really thought I would be able to help them, but in the moment of all confidence disappeared. Well, at least you tried to do the right thing, honey. Serving the weak untiringly and all that, eh? Okay. You know the pledge, but how? Oh, this is something I heard long, long ago. It stuck with me, though. And whatever happens, you mustn't forget forget it either. Serve the weak untiringly. Never retreat in the face of adversity and all the other stuff. See, I understand. And I don't be and don't be so hard on yourself. Sure, maybe you you didn't get to be the hero this time, but at least you tried. You'll make a fine knight one day, I'm sure. Gracias, señor. You are a truly wonderful person. In fact, you remind me of my master, the one who inspired me to become the, a caballero in the first place. You have cut, you have the same strength, the same spirit. For favor, senor. You must become my new master. I could learn so much, so much from you. Please, will you allow me to accompany you in your adventures? I will. Oh, who am I to stand in the way of a young caballero who wants to fulfill his destiny? You're more than welcome to join us, darling. Gracias, senor. I will honor the pledge and make you proud, I promise. Yay! You can now choose which Salvando's new friends will fight alongside in battle. Try talking to them when you're next at a ca campsite. Hmm. I don't know. I kind of like the, the people that we have now. He says, I don't think we're going to need it. That's kind of cool that they, that they have that there. You can just like choose who you can who can be in your party. Well, I can't get rid of David now, can I? David's too much. He's too cool. With you, we're gonna take a level of these travelers and thank you for coming. View of people adventure of the But what's more, the exotic sultan has. It was a couple of years and I think we can leave their homes unless I'm so in this area. It's a little wonder that the streets are so deserted. Not in, uh, not in my country, they're not. And as if they're not bad enough, I hear that the circus are referring to the final performance. Truly, there is less and less of the exact about it every day. And for those of you wondering what country I live in, it's America. Shocking, I know. But then again, there, there are a lot of people from Canada who do this. No wonder. No, we can't go in there. Now, where's the guy? There's a guy in here that, like... Wants to wants to juggle or whatever the heck. There he is. Oop. Greetings, stranger. I sense that you are looking for someone. Ha! Huh. Do not attempt to deny it. I know everything. What's more, I am the I am in a position to help you find the one that you seek. Be they a long lost brother or a brand new lover, my crystal balls will guide you guide you to them. Don't worry, I'm not in it for the money. I just thought that people might need a bit of the spiritual guidance. What would the soul having falling and all? The young man appears to have some talent. Invite him to take part in the circus? Yes. The Mondo invites him to the circus. You want me to join the circus? Gosh, even I didn't see that one coming. Are you sure about this? I mean, I'm just a fortune teller. Do you really think I'm going to fit the bill? I don't know, man. You're kind of juggling. I think you fit the bill. I tell you what. Why don't you let my crystal balls decide? Now listen carefully. I'm going to picture one and only one. One of these wondrous orbs, red, yellow, or blue. And all you've got to do is choose one. You pick the one I'm picturing, and I and I'll know we were destined to work together. I'll come enjoy the circus without 
further ado. Are you ready? Are you all set? Alright, I'm going to start picturing uh, one of them. Now, remember, all you have to do is choose which one it is. The, the ball is too low, the ball is too low. What color will they show us? If lies they tell, then off to hell. The dark place down below us. They speak of fire, they speak of flames, they speak of sunset glow, the balls tell all, the balls tell all, what color do they show? Alright, I'm picturing one of my crystal balls. Now, it's up to you to tell me which one it is. The red one? The red ball. Are you absolutely certain this is the one you want to choose? Well, you did it. You got it right. It looks like you've got some kind of connection. In case... In which case, my crystal ball and I are at your service. Let me know what you want to do at your circus. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you. Well, you did say something about, like, you know, red stuff, so... I only assumed. Do, we, do they have any new stuff? I'm kind of curious. Let's see, Zombies Bane, Rapier, Cast Iron, Claymore... Swordbreaker, Poison Moth, Nine Cruise Rain, Posey Rose, or Posey Pole, Fairy Staff, Iron Lance. I wanna do these have any nature based monsters? Red Brownie is head to the side. Nah. Now. Is that really all we needed? I wonder. I need some medicinal herbs though. Maybe some uh, antidotal herbs as well. Come in handy, you never know. Ole! Hup! Arriba! Yo. Whoa, how's the research for Dungtown? Do you need some hints about who to recruit? Sure. Alright, then listen up. Rumor has it that the best drummer in Gal. Ah, oh, yes, the drummer. Yes, yes. I know where he is. The little drummer, them. Because God forbid we call a boy a boy. It says that. There he is. It says, uh. Family guy. How can I make her smell again? I'm drumming seems to make no difference. This young man appears to have some talent, right? Yes. So the man to drum to the circus. What? The circus? Me? Well, it had it has always been an ambition of mine to perform alongside the great Silvando, but I'm afraid I can't help right now. It's my best friend, you see. She hasn't cracked so much as a single smile since Eat Yourself fell. I'm sure the right drum drumby would cheer her up, but I can't seem to find it, so I need to practice. Drumming your fingers to the bone, to the bone to put a smile on your friend's face, honey. You're my kind of guy. Say, how about I give you some help, and we'll make a deal while we're at it. If we can get your friend grinning again, you have to come and join the circus, okay? Really? You'll help me? That's amazing. If you can put a smile back on my friend's face, I'll be happy to join you. It won't be hard. It, it won't be hard to find my friend. She really stands out of the uh, from the crowd. She's got those fine bone structures, great posture, and long and these long, flustering eyelashes. She was hanging around the northwest in the city last time I saw her. I really want to. I, I really hope you can find a way to make her feel a little bit better. Hmm. I, I wonder. What happens if I talk to her? But the drummer's worried about me and he wants to put a smile on her face. I think you must be mistaken. We really know each other. He's probably thinking about Margarita. He's obsessed with that horse. Yeah. He's actually talking about this thing. This is Silvando's horse, isn't it? It's Margarita, Silvando's trusty steed. She looks terribly sad, as though she might cry at any moment. Margarita, darling, has this awful darkness that engulfed the world upset you too? Oh, it breaks my heart to see you suffering. Wait a minute. Fine bone structure, fabulous posture, and long flustering eyelashes? Why, the drummer must have been talking about Margarita. Oh, hello, Silvando. I just came to check on my friend here. I didn't expect to bump into you. Honey, I had no idea that this was your, this is who you were talking about. This is Margarita, my Margarita. What, Margarita's yours? Well, I suppose that explains why she's so fabulous. She certainly is, but you're right about her being in a bad way. I know how to put that right, that right though. She always, she's always been a fan of my dancing. You lay down the beat, darling, and I'll do my best. Well, I'll try. I warn you, though, my drumming doesn't seem to have had any effect on her so far. I don't think I've been doing it right. Oh, honey, there's nothing wrong with your drumming. It's just the visual ailment that's been lacking, I'm, I'm sure. Fortunately, that's where I come in. 
We'll help you too, won't you, boys? Let me put. Let's put our best feet forward and bring the smile back to Margarita's big long face. Right, old Sylph. To London friends and get into a fabulously funky group. You can actually see their da their dancing animations in this. It's funny. I like this. Nay, nay. Margarita is absolutely loving it. Oh, Savonda, look. Look how happy she is. You did it. You really did it. No, we did it. This was a, a team effort, darling. And now that Margarita's smiling again, we could do with those skills of yours at the circus. What do you say? If you really think my drumming can make a difference, I'd be happy to help you. Drumming agrees to perform the circus. By the way, it looks like Margarita wants to give you a little something for making her smile again. Gosh, it's certainly quite fragrant. Savonda receives a dollop of horse poo. They don't even call it dung in this game. Right. That's two that's two new towns sent up to the circus that did the big top ten. Let's go. Yes. Let's The rest of the bundle saved the day once more. We got two new recruits keen to perform with us in the final show, and it's all thanks to you. Everything's ready backstage, and the performers are waiting for their cues. We're all set. Not that we we can't start without our start ter, uh, turns, of course. I understand that we're not our stem. <laughs> Time to pre prepare for our grand entrance. Let the ringmaster know when you're all set. Where is the ringmaster? I don't know. Sorry, so I can't let you through. Everyone's trying to be friendly. Okay, so it's not back here. Where is Ringmaster? Da oh, there he is. God, I really need to sip some coffee. My throat is so dry. Well, darling, it's been a while. Sylv, what are you doing here? Oh, you know me, honey. I've never been able to stay away from the circus for long. Bravo, by the way. Most people would have thrown in the towel by now, but I always knew you were made of sterner stuff. Wait. Were you the one who found those new recruits for us as well? Goodness me, I don't know how to thank you. Oh, you don't need to thank me, honey. The only thing you need to do is give us, give me my cue. The Wandering Wanderer is ready to leap into the action once more. Alright, so if you're ready, then so are we. That's the spirit? Well, this is it, darlings. One last chance to bring some light into the dark, dark world. One last chance to gasp in the awe of the spectacle of the circus. One last glimpse of... The great Silvando. Aha, uh -huh, let's get the show on the road. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome one and all. I know it's a difficult time for all of us. But what better way to show off our indefatigable spirit than to fill the big top with joyful laughter and defiant exuberance? And believe me, that's what's going to happen. Because tonight, for one night only, for the first time since the glory days of the Gallipolitan Circus, the Wandering Wonder returns! Oh. <laughs> Welcome! <laughs> Welcome! Oh, hi! <laughs> hi! <laughs> ha! Clap your hands, stamp your feet, and get ready to smile like you've forgotten how to. I give you the great Silvando! Everybody, it's time to turn those frowns upside down. 
Prepare to be amazed! Silvando and Co. put on a stunning performance, and for one night at least, at least, the people of Galopolis are able to put their worries and cares behind them. After a jaw-dropping show, the curtains fall and a thunderous applause. Then morning comes. <laughs> well, Sylph, I've got to hand it to you. That was like nothing else this circus has ever seen. Thank you, from the bottom of my heart. Oh, darling, please. I just did a few party tricks, that's all. You're the real hero here. Keeping the show going in these dark times? No one else could have done that. <laughs> well, you know me. I've always been a firm believer in the healing power of laughter. And heaven knows, these people need it now more than ever. I don't think I ever told you who taught me about that power, did I? I saw her when I was just a child. She was simply the most incredible performer. She led a parade of people out of a kingdom destroyed by monsters and onto a new home and a brighter future. And she kept them smiling from start to finish. You can't imagine how inspirational it was for those of us who were lucky enough to wave them on their way. And then, when she'd taken them to safety, she disappeared just as suddenly as she'd arrived. We never saw her again. The rumors were that she died when she was still young. Such a tragedy. Still, they say she fell in love with a famous knight, and they got married. So it seems she found some happiness before her untimely end. You remind me of her, you know. That look on her face as she proudly led those people out of danger, spreading joy and laughter wherever she went. Well, if I needed inspiration to keep the circus going, you provided it in spades. The show must go on. These people need some light in their lives. Hmm. Did you hear that, darlings? It seems we've got a rival in the smile-spreading business. Well, we'll just have to work twice as hard. Uh, Mr. Silvando? Would you mind if we came with you? If this circus is going to stand any chance of keeping people laughing, it's going to need some performers who've learned from the best. Oh! Well, the more the merrier, of course. But I think we should see what the ringmaster has to say, don't you? Mm. Mm. Oh, you boys go with Sylv. Learn all you can from him, eh? I'll be expecting big things from you when you get back. Take good care of them, won't you? They're good lads, I promise. I promise. Life in the happiness restoring trade isn't all fun and games, you know? I'm going to be training you hard, and I expect you to become nothing less than the very best in the business. Sir, sir yes, yes, sir! sir. Yeah! Oh, yes. Looking like JoJo over here, these, these three. All right, we got one more place to visit at Silvando. Man, I like the circus. You ever been to the circus? It's amazing. It's amazing what people can do. I wonder. Ah, oh, nothing. Now, I'm trying to remember some things from the circus that I've ever, that I've seen that were like amazing. But everybody knows about like those uh 
like the like the ribbon people that like sw that like uh, swing and spin on like ribbons that hang from the ceiling. There's also trapeze people. There's also like these like these uh, acrobatic acrobatic people that like uh, that like uh, uh, the, 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 uh like they stack each other, you know, like they jump and then they oh, it's a shadow monster. Oh, what's this guy? Oh, you poor thing! It breaks my heart to see you like this. If I could, oh hello there. Hmm. Oh no. This isn't a monster, I promise you. Well, it didn't start as one at least. It actually, it's actually a common or garden plant. And a very beautiful one too. It's one from Laguna di Gondolia originally. And it's simply breathtaking when it's in bloom. Sadly, when the world went to pot and the darkness fell, plants underwent all kinds of metamorphosis and mutations. And even started wandering around causing mischief like this one. It breaks my heart, to re it really does. That's why I decided to try and do something about it. I'm a botanist, you see, and I've invented a special fertilizer that should restore this little fellow into it into his former glory. I've almost, I, I've got almost all the ingredients. I just need one more thing still: horse poo. The smellier, the better. I'd go and fetch some myself, but I can't just abandon my little friend here. I worry he'll panic and start attacking passersby. Say. You look like a helpful sort. I don't suppose you'd go and get some horse poo for me, would you? Sure. Sure thing, honey. One steaming mound of horse manure coming right up. Right up. We'll have all your friend looking fabulous again, before you know it. Oh, thank you ever so much. Now, I don't know how much... How much about... I don't know much about horses. Plants are my thing, not animals. But I've heard there are lots of horses... Uh, lots of them in Galopolis. Maybe there'd be a good place to start looking. I guess what? No, oh, I know that sweet, sweet aroma anywhere. You've you've done as I asked, and I why don't you just take it? Bond is using the horse poop to mix up a batch of fertilizer. He then applies it it liber liberally in to the soil around the plant the, the base of the plant. The plant seems to calm down a little bit before pulling up its roots and wandering off. Look at that, it worked. Thank you ever so much for your help. My little friend have toddled off back to the Laguna de Gondolia. I'd imagine here is hoping he, he has a nice, quiet life from now on. Here, here. It's no good to know if it's just, a, it's just humans we're capable of helping. All living things need a hand from time to time. That's right, especially with the way the world is now. There must be so many plants out there suffering just like the poor little fellow was. I wish I could help them all, really I do. Wait, I have an idea. Why don't I travel around with you and your friends? That's surely the best way to help help as many plants as possible. What do you say? Will you help me come with you? Sure. Of course, honey. The more the merrier. If there are plants out there that are suffering, it's up to us to stop it and save them. Well, it's just wonderful. Thank you ever so much. I'll warn you now. I'm not much good. I'm not much good at fighting. I do know a thing or two about the natural world, though. Yeah, it's always useful. Yay! I wonder, how many people are actually following me? Ah, oh, it's just my party members. That sucks. And they do the, like the little, yeah, the little swing. I like that. It's nice. Anyways, let, let us go, yes? Do these guys, yep, shadows. And even the, the, whatever the heck those things are called. The globby mages. Happy beat. Yep. Oh, I just realized we have the juggler. We got the leader with us. We got the 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 juggler, the 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 the, 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 the whatever the heck that one guy with the feather is. I knew we'd win. <laughs> that sounded so funny. He didn't even get the slap. It just goes. Boom. <laughs> it sounded like we just kind of hit the hit the poor guy for no reason. 
Two, four, six, eight. Going to get you feeling great. Hold still. Dose of cognitive. I wonder who voices all these people. David just kind of stands still. I just realized that. How close are we to leveling up? Just one, actually. Let's see if we can just get the, the this one guy. He gives off pretty good at EXP. Yes, yes. It's gonna be stuck in my head for a while, isn't it? Huh. Is that all you got? Hey, there we go, 35. What can we get? Yo oh okay, there you go. Gold rush charm plus forty. Dual wielding, don't need that. Pride Piper, man, the melody that can be out and let it be with brilliance. Does this mean I can charm them? I can charm monsters? That could be kind of cool, right? Well, we don't have anything for anything, so just keep going. Luckily, I was able to. Ooh, what's going on here? Halt! None shall pass. I promise to protect these people, and this is what I shall do. Gulp. Easy there, honey. We don't mean to you any harm. Quite the opposite, actually. We're traveling around looking for people who might need our help. Well, you must be mad it, with the with the world with the world the way it is now. Mind you, you still you 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 do yeah I see me here. Like you can handle yourself. In fact. There might even be something you can do for me. I'm a martial artist, you see. And I said I'd help uh, these people get food from the village in Hoto. However, or whatever is going on with the world, it seems to be played havoc with their crop production. Anyway, we were on our way back to the village when we got attacked by vicious monsters. It roughed us up pretty it up, uh, good and proper. It stole all the food we collected. I was supposed to protect them. But I didn't stand a chance against that thing all by myself. If you were if you were with me though, it'd be a different story. So how about it? Fancy going to get those supplies back. Sure. You bet, honey. The monster's the monster's going to learn the way that it can't go around swiping people's dinners. Not from under their noses. Well thank you, thank you so much. As long as we stick together, that thing won't stand a chance. It should be loitering somewhere in the south of Hoto. I'm sure we'll be we'll beat it easily. Well, let's make sure we're properly prepared anyway, eh? Do not worry, we are good. At least I hope we are. Yes, yes! Dun, 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 dun. Oh crap, there's a... Uh, Cyclops now. Ooh, Cyclops now. She slimes. They're still here. Well, yeah. It's not like it's gonna change or anything. Grr her her her. More humans. More food. Give me or I squish. Grr her her. Where can we find the grub pinching monster? Sylph. Ready to have a crack at him in? Sure. A gigantus. Oh, so it's not a cyclops. Alright, you lot. Let's show this blighter what's what. Alright, I'm guessing that this thing is gonna be a problem, so let's go ahead and do this. Vulnerable fertilizer. Two, four, six, eight. Going to get you feeling great. Get all. I'm here to help. Thank you. Thank you, Davey. 
Hey, poor Davy. Jeez, this guy. Mirchi, remedy heal. Nothing much that we can do here. Well, my tap dance is a, is a going away. Yeah, let's just let's just attack it. I was itching to dance. Take oh, this poor this. guy! <laughs> this poor guy, he just wants to dance, but he can't because we're already buffed. He moved slightly to the left. It's genius! I, I wonder if there's a randomizer for this. You think so? Like, like a, like a randomizer that randomizes, like, uh, you know, Monsters? That'd be kind of fun, wouldn't it? I think so. Randomizers are fun. At least I think randomizers are fun. It's like my whole shtick when it comes to this channel. I know there's Castlevania's uh, randomizers. How much health does this guy have? That much. Ha ha winner. The well known co defeated the Gigantus. The villagers recover all the stolen food and take it back to Hoto. Thank you so much for your help. I really couldn't have done it without you, you know? You're really quite something. Risking your life to help a bunch of strangers like that? That's pretty amazing. I want to, to be like you too. But I don't think I've got what it takes yet. Hey, maybe if I spend time with you, it might help. What do you say? Is it alright if I tag along with, with you for a while? Yes. Of course, darling. You'll be the best, most helpful martial art artist in the business by the time I'm done with you. Just you wait and see. Thank you so much. This, this is going to be a great a bit, a journey of a lifetime. I can feel it in my bones. I can tell he's serious, because martial arts is all about bones. That's an old load of smiles we put back there in people's faces now. I reckon we've done all we can around these parts, Sylv. Why don't we head over to Oto and see how Tattoo's getting along? We did promise we'd visit. We did. I wonder if there's any more people that we can uh, recruit. Here we are then. Oto at last. Ready to aid in? Yes. Right, o Oto. Here we come. Let's hope Tattoo's come home, eh? Are there people that we missed? I'm actually not sure. Or is that everybody? I, I don't Yoo really know. Teddy Wetty Woo Bags! Woo Bags? Silvando, you came! But of course I did! And who's this ravishing young thing, huh? Hmm. I am his mother. And you must be Silvando. Gratitude is due. When the world tree fell, I thought my boy had been lost. I drowned in despair. But now he is home. My worries clear like the clouds. And all thanks to you. <laughs> God, would you look at that. You really do perk people up wherever you go, eh, Syl? A right little soldier of smile, you are. Hmm, soldier of smile. Who I like it. All right, listen up, boys. Oh, oh. We all know what a dark place the world is these days. But if there's one thing I've learned by helping people like Tetsu here, it's the power of the smile. No matter how bad things get, no matter how much you cry or how powerless you feel, a single grin can bring hope for a better tomorrow. 
There's nothing this world needs more than happy faces right now. So that's just what we're going to give it. Yay! You're so right, Sylv. We're with you all the way. Oi! Who said you could start calling him plain old Sylv, you cheeky toe rag? <laughs> Jeez, Debbie. Oh, I get it. We can't go spreading smiles if we're mistering and surring left and right, eh? Fair enough. Sylve yourself, silly boys. Great idea, boss. Sylve it is. I'm with you all the way too, Sylve. Let's get out there and save the world! Yeah! I mean, yay! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> that little dick at the end. Oh, boys. You don't know how much this means to me. This parade's gonna change everything. I just know it. From this day forth, you shall journey across the land, vanquishing the blight of despair with the righteous power of happiness. I hereby dub you... <gasps> the Soldiers of Smile! If it please you, sir, my son would like to join you in spreading sunlight. All right, boys. Me and my mum have made a little something that's going to knock your socks off. So how come Tetsu doesn't speak in haiku? <gasps> <gasps> I told you I'd thank you properly if you came to visit. Now you can travel the world in style. Oh. Wow. <laughs> that smile. We've made something for you too, Sylv. To say thanks, you know. Close your eyes. <gasps> oh. oh my, I love it. Thank you so much, my special little soldiers. <laughs> yeah. Let's have that snivel, you. There's people out there need our help in case you've forgotten. Hmm. <sighs> oh. Look out, world! Here we come! I know you're still out there. All of you. We'll meet again soon. I just know it. And until then, I'll be doing my best to make the world a better place. And so ends Salvando's end of this story. Oh boy, it is quite nice, isn't it? Man, I relate to Salvando a lot. A smile is just something that I just really like. Jade journeys forth. So this is about Jade. Here she is. Octagonia. Finally. You there? You're not from around here, are you? Well, let me give you a piece of advice. One traveler to another. Steer well clear of that city. It's in a right old state. The stories I've been hearing are enough to make your hair stand on end. Thanks for the warning, but I'm going in anyway. If the people there are suffering, I can't leave them to their fate. Things are bad enough these days without that. Blimey. There aren't many like you around. Most people are just out for themselves since Yggdrasil fell. Well, good luck to you. You'll need it. Oh. 
I know I'm not alone in this. If you're still out there, you'll be doing exactly the same thing as me. And that's how I'm going to find you. I just have to keep looking. Yes. Alrighty then. So, this is where we're gonna end it off. Next time we're gonna be setting aside a, a Jade's part of the story. And I think Rob is next. We're, and I think his is like the, the shortest one. So, yeah. So, without further ado, I hope you all have... Wait, can I still do this? I can. So, without further ado, I hope you all have a wonderful day. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Bye.